Good day, everyone! This is Teacher Rainily S. Gomarcha, and I will be your learning body through your English 10 journey. Today, we are going to go through your English 10, Quarter 1, Module 5, entitled Prove Me Wrong. Are you ready for the new lesson? All right! Before we start, here are the things you are about to do in this lesson. At the end of the lesson, you are expected to Number 1. Identify words or phrases that signal and support the generalization and exaggeration in statements. Number 2. Clarify expressions stating unsupported generalizations and exaggerations. And number three, realize the importance of truthful information. To start off, kindly bring out your English 10 module, pen, and a sheet of paper or notebook. To activate your prior knowledge, let's begin with this task. Let us try. Classify the statements below as unsupported generalization or an exaggeration. Write the statements inside the box with the correct heading above. This chart shows a breakdown of your answers. Number 1. All Filipinos are good singers. Number 2. I am the best volleyball player in the world. Number 3. Try this new spectacular contact lenses that will make your eyes shiny, shimmering, splendid without any effort involved. Number 4. Professional athletes are typically rich. Number 5. Many people would agree that jobless persons are all lazy. Number 6. I ate too much cassava cake. I must weigh more than a weight. Number 7. Maria never stops talking. Number 8. All men are strong. Number 9. I will stand for you forever. And number 10, all teachers wear high heels when teaching. Let us check your answers. In unsupported generalizations, the correct answers are the following. Number 1, all Filipinos are good singers. Number 4, professional athletes are typically rich. Number 5, Many people would agree that jobless persons are all lazy. Number 8. All men are strong. And number 10. All teachers wear high heels when teaching. In exaggerations, the correct answers are Number 2. I am the best volleyball player in the world. Number 3. Try this new spectacular contact lenses that will make your eyes shiny, shimmering, splendid without any effort involved. Number 6. I ate too much cassava cake. I must weigh more than a whale. Number 7. Maria never stops talking. And number 9. I will stand for you forever. Did you get a perfect score? Then, you are amazing! Before we proceed to our new lesson, I want you to go over in this test. Let us study. Examine the following pictures and answer the questions that follow. Or, you can watch this short video clip and give your observation afterwards. On the screen is the first example of the pictures. Let us process the following questions. 
Number 1. What is the picture all about? Yes, you're right. The picture is all about a man advertising a product. Number 2. What does it say about the product? Correct. The product is the secret of those who are handsome. Number 3. Do you believe in that? Why? The answer is no. We don't believe in it because we don't have to use any beauty product to look good. What matters is how we improve ourselves holistically. Number 4. Can we consider it generalization? Yes! Number 5. So, in what way can you clarify this generalization so that it will be acceptable? What words should you add or change to make the generalization acceptable? The answer is, I think the generalization is unsupported because there are no statistical data or figures that will prove it. Master Oil Control Deep Cleanser helps men to have a better skin. Another example of the pictures is shown on the screen. Let us process the following questions. Number 1. What is the picture all about? Yes, you're right. The picture is all about a beauty product. Number 2. What does it say about the woman having problems on her wrinkles? Yes, it can last wrinkles in only 60 minutes. Number 3. Do you believe in what it states about the beauty product endorsed? Why? And the answer is no. We don't believe in it because we don't have to use any beauty product to look beautiful. Again, what matters is how we improve ourselves generally. Number 4. Can we consider it an exaggeration? The answer is yes. Number 5. How do you clarify this exaggeration? What words should you add or change to make the exaggeration acceptable? The answer is, the beauty product cream can really lessen wrinkles but not in instantly. Well, I guess you already have the idea of what really is our lesson for today. Our lesson for today is about unsupported generalization and exaggeration. What is unsupported generalization? Unsupported generalization occurs when you come up to a conclusion but with incomplete or no data. For example, Women are poor drivers. What is exaggeration? Exaggeration is a statement that makes something worse or better than it really is. It is the use of additional causative agents into the mix when it is not needed. For example, joining a sweepstakes will make you an instant millionaire. Unsupported generalization and exaggerations are information or ideas that are based on nothing. They give baseless details and it can lead readers and listeners to the wrong idea. Thus, these ideas are useless. All, none, most, many, always, often, everyone, 
never, sometimes, some, usually, seldom, few, generally, overall, as a general rule, are words that signal generalization statements. And now, let's take a look at this test. Let's answer. Directions. Tell whether the sentences below express unsupported generalization or exaggerated expression. Number one, it takes a lifetime to forgive someone who had gravely wronged you. Number two, living with you is life like a hell. Number three, I sneeze at the same time the power went off. My sneeze did something to make the power go off. Number four. If you don't do your homework, you'll fail the class. Number five. Generally speaking, men are emotionally susceptible of all. Number six. His brain is the size of a pea. Number seven. Carlito wore blue socks to basketball practice, and he did many shots in the ring. Carlito decides to wear blue socks to every basketball practice. Number 8. My cat only has dog friends. Number 9. Payday loan and credit card companies are just like opportunistic vultures. They always strike at victims when they're at their weakest. Number 10. Now crack the code to younger acting scheme. Use new youth code cream, the youth regenerating skin care. Let us check your answers. Number 1. Exaggerated expression. Number 2. Exaggerated expression. Number three, unsupported generalization. Number four, unsupported generalization. Number five, unsupported generalization. Number six, exaggerated expression. Number seven, unsupported generalization. Number eight, unsupported generalization. Number nine, unsupported generalization and number 10 exaggerated expression did you get all the correct answers great work moving on to the next test let us practice directions read the following text carefully identify from the sentences as unsupported generalization or exaggeration and write them under the upper plate heading in the box clarify these expressions by substituting them with more appropriate words or supporting statements the first one is done for you number two most people find church boring number three everyone likes a little bit of excitement and variety in their life Number 4. Ask Judurant ensures that extremely attractive woman will run after you begging for love, regardless of what you look like or what you do. Number 5. Philippines are malnourished and unhealthy because of focusing too much on social media. Number 6. Energizer batteries last almost an eternity. Number 7. Tabasco chili sauce is so hot, your breath will set fire to things and melt plastic. Number 8. Men are all afraid of commitment. Number 9. The car went faster than the speed of light. Number 10. Red Bull makes you sprout wings and fly. Literally. And number 11, people with black hair are good in chess. Let us check your answers. 
Since number 1 is already given, let's proceed to number 2. The answer is unsupported generalization. The supporting statement is few people find church boring. Number 3. Unsupported generalization. The supporting statement is most people like a little bit of excitement and variety in their life. Number 4. Exaggeration. The supporting statement is Ox smells okay, but will not actually make you irresistible to woman. Number 5. Unsupported generalization. The supporting statement is Philippines are malnourished and unhealthy because of poor quality of diets. Number 6. Exaggeration. The supporting statement is Energizer battery lasts as long as any other batteries, but it isn't the case. Number 7. Exaggeration. The supporting statement is Tabasco chili sauce that won't actually give you superhuman dragon breath. Number 8. Unsupported generalization. The supporting statement is not all men afraid of commitment. Number 9. Exaggeration. The supporting statement is, The car went really fast. Number 10. Exaggeration. The supporting statement is, Red Bull will give you a bit more energy, but won't give you wings. And number 11. Unsupported generalization. The supporting statement is, not just only black hair people are good in chess. Did you get all the correct answers? Right? Well, I guess you did. Let's proceed to the next task. Let us practice more. Directions. I have here different pictures. Analyze each of them and formulate your own unsupported generalization and exaggeration statement. Picture number one. What is your answer? Mm-hmm. What a brilliant idea. How about picture number two? What is your answer? Very good! Picture number three. What is your answer? Correct! And how about picture number four? What is your answer? You're right! In picture number five, what is your answer? Great! And how about in picture number 6? What is your answer? Impressive! Let's move on to picture number 7. What is your answer? Correct! And lastly, picture number 8. What is your answer? Excellent! Alright class, all your answers are acceptable. You really have your brilliant ideas about this lesson. Let us remember that unsupported generalization is a broad statement which cannot be concluded from the essay evidence or details. For example, all Americans support a strong national defense. Exaggeration. It means the describing of something and making it more than it really is. For example, I was walking along when suddenly this enormous dog walked along. It was as big as an elephant. Unsupported generalizations and exaggerations 
are baseless information which can mislead listeners or readers. Unless additional information to support them is available, do not believe them immediately. Check them for accuracy and truthfulness. The following words are some of the signals of generalization statements. All, none, most, many, always, often, everyone, never, sometimes, some, usually, seldom, few, generally, and overall. Since we are done with our discussion, let us move on to the next task. Let us assess. Directions. Read and understand the passage given below. After reading, answer the following questions. Like Anita, you too can become successful even if you were not able to finish a four-year college course. In fact, everybody who has completed vocational skills training is successful and is very rich. So, if you want to become successful, always remember that there are other options aside from college. You can contact your nearest TESDA office to inquire about the programs they offer. What are you waiting for? Make the move towards success now. After reading the text, I'd like you to answer the following questions in your notebook or paper. Question number one. What is the passage all about? Question number two. Would you believe the statement stated in the passage? Why? Number three. Can you identify an unsupported generalization in the above passage? What sentence can you find it? Number four. Was there an exaggeration? What sentence can you find it? Question number five. How can you make the passage better? Let us check your answers. Did you now get all the answers correct? Great job! Let's proceed to the next task. Let us enhance. Directions. Compose a paragraph about politics that contains unsupported generalizations and exaggerations. Clarify each baseless statement and make another paragraph that is fair and balanced. Paragraph that contains unsupported generalizations and exaggerations. Paragraph that contains fair and balanced statement. Reminder, your output will be graded using the rubric on the screen. Use the rubric as a guide when writing a paragraph and check it again before you submit. Another reminder, you have to follow the instructions given by your teacher when you submit your output. In the whirlwind of destructed communications, you must rely on the truthfulness of a certain matter to avoid misunderstanding and the like. An unsupported generalization applies what is true of one person or thing to everybody and all similar things. Exaggerations are overstatements. They claim more than what is true. An unsupported generalization and exaggeration may create chaos in any way, may it verbal or may be nonverbal communication. In our everyday life, we meet and converse to other individuals. It is essential when you are in a situation wherein you receive an oral information. It is best to analyze, validate the information we see, hear, or read. Congratulations on accomplishing this module. You have gained another learning experience even being at home. That's all for today. Goodbye and God bless everyone. Again, this is Teacher Rainily S. Gomarcha.